China has just taken a giant leap in space exploration. The Long March 8 rocket completed a full rehearsal at the nation's first commercial space launch site in Hainan province. This isn't just a routine test. It's a game-changing moment that could reshape the global commercial space industry. With this rocket bridging critical gaps in payload capabilities and a new launch pad dedicated to commercial missions, China's space ambitions are skyrocketing. In this video, we'll dive deep into how these developments are transforming the future of space exploration and why they matter to all of us. Have you ever wondered how satellites the size of small trucks make it into space? Enter China's Long March 8 rocket, a game changer that's filling a critical niche in orbital launches. First taking flight in December 2020, the Long March 8 is designed to carry payloads between 3 to 5 tons into sun-synchronous orbits. This capability is significant because it addresses a gap in China's launch capacities, allowing for more flexibility and efficiency in deploying satellites for Earth observation, communication, and scientific research. Recently, the Long March 8 underwent a comprehensive week-long rehearsal at the number one launch pad in Wenchang, Hainan province. This wasn't just a routine check. It was a full-scale simulation that tested everything from subsystem compatibility to emergency response protocols. Engineers ran through fueling procedures and even simulated propellant dumping to ensure that every aspect of the rocket's performance is up to par. This meticulous preparation sets the stage for an upcoming launch scheduled around the end of this year, which will be the inaugural mission from China's first commercial space launch site. So why is this rehearsal such a big deal? Well, it's not every day that a new rocket is tested at a brand new launch facility dedicated exclusively to commercial missions. The successful rehearsal signals that both the rocket and the launch site are ready for prime time. It also showcases China's commitment to advancing its space technology and expanding its presence in the commercial space market. Moreover, the Long March 8 is more than just a new rocket, it's a symbol of innovation and progress. By incorporating modern technologies and design philosophies, it aims to reduce launch costs and increase reliability. This is particularly important as the demand for satellite launches continues to grow, driven by the need for global connectivity and advanced Earth observation capabilities. The Long March 8 rocket is a crucial piece of China's expanding space puzzle. Its successful rehearsal not only demonstrates technological prowess, but also paves the way for more frequent and flexible access to space. As we look forward to its upcoming launch, it's clear that this rocket is set to play a significant role in both national and international space endeavors. Let's shift our focus to the place where all this excitement is unfolding the new commercial space launch site in Hainan province. Nestled in the city of Wenchang on China's southern island, this launch site is the country's first facility dedicated solely to commercial space missions. Construction began in July 2022, and in just over a year, it's ready to host the inaugural launch of the Long March 8 rocket. But what's so special about this launch site? For starters, its geographical location is a strategic gem. Being closer to the equator, rockets launching from Hainan can take advantage of the Earth's rotational speed, making launches more fuel efficient. This efficiency can translate into cost savings and increased payload capacities, a big win for commercial clients looking to get their satellites into orbit. The number one launch pad at Wenchang is equipped with state-of-the-art facilities designed to accommodate new generation rockets like the Long March 8. The site features advanced tracking systems, modern control centers, and streamlined logistics to support rapid launch turnovers. This means that not only can China increase the frequency of its launches, but it can also offer these services to international clients seeking reliable and cost-effective launch options. The establishment of this commercial launch site is a significant move for China as it seeks to position itself as a major player in the global commercial space industry. By providing dedicated facilities for commercial launches, China is encouraging private sector participation and fostering an environment of innovation and competition. This could lead to more partnerships, both domestically and internationally, further boosting the country's space capabilities. Moreover, having a dedicated commercial launch site helps alleviate congestion at other launch facilities that are often tied up with government and military missions. 
This separation allows for more flexibility in scheduling and can accelerate the development of new technologies and services in the commercial space sector. In essence, the Hainan launch site is more than just a physical location, it's a strategic investment in the future of space exploration and commercialization. Now, let's talk about the bigger picture, the explosive growth of China's commercial space industry. Just a few years ago, in 2019, the industry was valued at around 800 billion yuan, which is approximately 112 billion US dollars. Fast forward to 2023, and that number has more than doubled to 1.9 trillion yuan. By the end of 2024, it's expected to reach a staggering 2.34 trillion yuan. That's a phenomenal rate of growth in a relatively short period. So what's driving this surge? Several factors are at play. First, there's strong government support and favorable policies that encourage private investment and innovation in the space sector. China has been opening up its space industry to private companies, providing opportunities for startups and established firms alike to contribute to space technology and services. Second, technological advancements have made space more accessible than ever. The development of reusable rockets, like the upcoming 4-meter and 5-meter diameter rockets that the China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation CASC is working on, is set to revolutionize the industry. These rockets are scheduled for their first flights in 2025 and 2026, respectively, and aim to reduce launch costs significantly by reusing key components. Third, there's an increasing global demand for satellite launches and space-based services from telecommunications and internet connectivity to Earth observation and scientific research. The applications are vast. China's expanding launch capabilities and competitive pricing make it an attractive option for both domestic and international clients. However, this rapid growth isn't without its challenges. The global commercial space market is highly competitive, with established players like SpaceX and emerging ones in Europe and other parts of Asia. China will need to continue innovating and perhaps focus on unique value propositions to stand out. Environmental concerns are also becoming more prominent. With more launches comes increased debris and potential impacts on the Earth's atmosphere. Addressing these issues through sustainable practices and international cooperation will be crucial for the industry's long-term viability. As we've explored, the successful rehearsal of the Long March 8 rocket at China's first commercial space launch site is more than just a test run. It's a significant milestone that heralds a new era in space exploration and commercial activity. Also, the Hainan launch site itself is a strategic asset, positioning China favorably in the competitive landscape of global space launches. Thank you for joining us on this journey through China's exciting developments in space exploration. If you found this video informative and thought-provoking, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insights into the ever-evolving world of astronomy and space technology. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.